Hello dear friends, thanks for joining me today. Uh, the reason I wanted to record this video is to show you the benefits of using uh, Dev Essentials subscription uh, from Microsoft. It's uh, totally free. You can basically join with any uh, Outlook or any kind of Microsoft uh, account. And um, if you go to this URL, myvisualstudio.com, um, and join this program, you would be able to see some uh, you know, benefits for you. One thing is uh, LinkedIn, LinkedIn Learning. For one month, you can get it uh, for free without putting your credit card number. Uh, this will work. Also, if you are into Microsoft 365, you can get uh, a developer subscription where you can uh, experiment with any service, basically including Power Automate, etc. E5, this is kind of the highest level that uh, Microsoft 365 offers. So uh, yeah, you, you, you should be able to do most of the functionality here. Also, uh, this one, Azure free account, uh, you have to put your credit card. So uh, if you do not want to do it, then it will not work. But uh, if you do that, uh, Microsoft will not charge you for this uh, and you can still uh, test Azure in uh, some, some services over there. Uh, this one, Azure DevOps. So this is like um, for infra as code, right? If you want to use some Git repositories, it's kind of alternative to GitHub, right? In, in GitHub, uh, you can uh, store your code and then run some actions and with Azure DevOps it's a similar thing so you can get like a free git uh, repositories and create pipelines and uh, yeah just test some um, EAC or infra as code there uh, you can get also uh, Visual Studio Code uh, on the other hand it's free anyway so you do not really need uh, this dev essentials for that but it's a nice editor, uh, a lot of companies are using it. You can also get the developer plan for Power Apps. So if you're working with Power Apps, that would be nice. Uh, Power BI free plan, it's not really uh, necessary because it's already included in all uh, services. If you want to work with Power BI, you could consider using this uh, developer subscription and uh, you get a paid plan with a higher uh, tier over there so um, you can get a discount for Microsoft exam they say it's 50% discount but I think they offer it for most people anyway so I'm not sure if it's really useful uh, plural site one month this is a really nice uh, online learning platform and uh, you do not need to specify a credit card also so you get it for free for one month Alternatively, you can get a trial for one week if you go directly to the Plural site. So uh, this is a little bit better because first you do not provide a credit card and second one, uh, it's uh, for one month instead of one week. You can subscribe to Digital Magazine uh, for one year and uh, they will uh, send you uh, each month, uh, they will send you a copy of this magazine, which is very good if you are into uh, code. Um, with uh, a lot of uh, you know news which come out in that area and of course you can get some kind of access to Microsoft tech community so uh, these are all the benefits for me what I found personally the most beneficial was a Microsoft 365 developer subscription uh, and also uh, this Azure DevOps to work with some uh, infra as code elements to automate your uh, resources creation, etc. This is very nice. Um, and uh, of course, if you want to learn something, plural site for one month is nice. Um, and as I mentioned, you can get only you can create only a free account for Microsoft, so not, not paid account is necessary. Uh, yeah, so please do not underestimate. It's a nice feature. It's totally free from Microsoft. So just just feel free to use it and explore um, And the product keys, right? You could probably get some product keys, but I'm not sure if 
um, if that would be beneficial. It's probably from some older um, uh, things. So uh, yeah, this is not really useful. Uh, but uh, for um, these things that I mentioned, uh, it's nice. So yeah, hope it will help you to keep learning and develop. Thanks for joining today. Have a wonderful day. Thank you. Bye-bye.